lot better ever since he heard about Come on. I know this place is off limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we got to break the rules. come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there. Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. This way. Be careful. Where do you think they went? Who knows? They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope you find them. This is wrong. Sorry. Get ready. That's that. Here we go. Let's get this over with. And we're safe. I've got this. Don't you mean we've got this? Huh? Let's do this. That'll do. Brace yourself. Go on! Not alone. Try to stay behind me. That way, I can cover your back. Get ready. It's ah. over. Huh? One more it. shot. It's over. Let's go. Try to stay behind me. That way, I can cover your back. Here we go. That'll do. Sorry. This won't take long. That'll do. Enough. This won't take long. Quickly, we gotta save them. All right. Yeah! <laughs> 
No holding back. Bring it. 
Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It was really cool when you went like. Yeah. Yeah. You've got it all wrong. Like that. No way. It was way faster than that. Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Fine. Then how about. Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Isn't that right, Cloud? Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like... I don't know how to explain. I see. Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come with me. The reunion. There's nothing to Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. Oh, then you must be from the legendary... The legendary... My dad told me that that man... He used to be a soldier when he was younger. Hey, Cloud. I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry. I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Oh my, is that a Moogle? You can see me, Koopa? Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopa. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, are you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Kubo. 
Anyway, we've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But you'll need to buy a membership first. If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. I see you're working hard, Mr. Merc. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. Koopa. Until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile from ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys. today. Take care of my equipment, you hear? Flowers! Lovely, oh. don't you think? Great job. It's wonderful. <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? <sighs> that would be wonderful! There are five of them out on patrol right now. 
They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. Your guys are awesome. I want to be strong and tough when I grow up, too. You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are going to have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh, man, I completely forgot. I have to get back right now. Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. I'll handle it. You will? Oh man, you're the best! I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. So Be careful, they look the dangerous. My very first Undercity night out. Sure would love S80 that screws. I made it first. You won't stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. Hey there, how goes the patrol? Hmm. Great, I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions. <sighs> Plus I helped an old lady cross the street. You've been busy. It's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh no! I'm late! Did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! Where are you going? Well, I saw myself. Don't move. I'm sure. Back to work. Did I just say that out loud? That four. Mind taking a look? Get your hands on the hottest new Neighborhood watch. We're talking about Paris, drop by and get down here right this second. Did you know? Oh, loud? Hey there. How goes the patrol? There's a lot more people on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! Let's try and jump... Wow! You're that soldier, right? Can I ask you a super important question? I heard bad people broke the Mako reactor, and there's gonna be another war because of it. Is that true? Who knows? But isn't there something else you should be worrying about right now? I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! I really like Miss Folia's lesson. One boy spends most of his time checking out the shops. And don't forget, they all wear homemade swords on their backs. Thanks again for agreeing to help you guys. I can't believe I forgot all about the lesson! I know you can do it! Can I pet him? That's what's called easy money. We've a couple of drinks out. 
You won't stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. I can't wait to hear what you're trying to say about it. We all need to help the world to spring. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. We to get rough! Go on! Can't you leave us alone? No. Here we go. Pay attention. Gotta get a little payback. Feeling chilly? Come on. Go on. Get ready. Here it comes. This is it. Not looking good. Soldiers. First class. Come on! No holding back. Go on! Gotta be careful. Let's get this over with. This one is going in. I'll take care of you. Okay. So, you had enough yet? No, I don't believe that I have. Stop it! Can't. It's my job. Then think about changing careers. All good. I'll 
end this. Cloud's pretty strong, isn't it? I've seen this type of thing. You don't know me. Right. Stay strong, okay? That payback working out for you. <laughs> needed on standby for a job at something about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that.
You're heading in already? Nah, not quite yet. them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Uh, but that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. Many believe that war is inevitable. That's everyone. These Let's go back to the house. They won't hurt at the surface. Harris, drop by and uh... I'm very sorry. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. You guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money! The Watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us! Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do! And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves! I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. I'm sorry we had to give you such a dangerous job, but there's really no one else we could have asked. You're our only hope. Yeah. Hey, my house is this way. I wish I Well, Shinra's not gonna take his line now. Doubt.
Okay then. Was never in doubt. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. That's it. All right. Here we go. Enough. <laughs> Nothing to it. Man, come on. No holding back. <laughs> All right. Sorry. Go on. Here we go. Let's get this over. Never again. Okay, 
Okay, up and at him. Guess it wasn't meant to Steady. be. Should have been there. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the King and his smelly friends! Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. A real family, in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. No idea. Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. <laughs>